Teradin is a valuable tool to show the originality and integrity of any kind of a research document. And if you want to submit your document, either a thesis or a research paper, you have to submit a Teradin report along with. Most of the students found it difficult to analyze the plagiarism report of Teradin. And in this video, we are going to bifurcate this and we'll evaluate the plagiarism report of Teradin about your document. And we will study that how you can use this information to make any kind of a future changes in your document regarding paraphrasing or rephrasing or removing plagiarism. This specific document showing us the plagiarism that is 18% and this means that there are different kind of a plagiarisms can be detected in the highlighted areas that can either be a improper rephrasing, improper citation or improper reference. So for example when we click on this number we will get a different kind of uh, sources from where this information have been gathered and found issues regarding authenticity of that specific information. When we click on a number one, it will take us to the area where the number one plagiarism exists and will also highlight the source document by highlighting those specific sentences and lines which have been copied as such in that specific document. For example, this specific line have been copied from the original source without making any changes. So Teratin detected is as a plagiarized content and when we click on the number two we can see that same kind of uh, rephrasing issues are there and when we click on for example number seven cause submitted paper remain the intellectual property for the authors and instructors so for that purpose they said that they cannot show the original content over here but this specific area have been copied and pasted in the original doc without putting any specific reference that's why it's have been highly highlighted as a plagiarized content. So there are different kind of a plagiarism occurs and the beautiful thing about a turn it and plagiarism report is this that it link your highlighted area with the original document and mention you the specific kind of a plagiarism that how you can cross check it by matching the original information and can make changes. So but just looking at the plagiarism report very carefully you can tackle this ratio of plagiarism by rephrasing properly by putting the specific quotes under commas and by putting the proper reference of the information and this specific issue of plagiarism will be resolved in your document. I hope so you found this video informative and will help you to tackle the plagiarism issues in your document. You can also watch my other videos in which I talk about the type of plagiarism, the manual correction and AI tools which are going to help you to remove the plagiarism in your document. You can find all these videos in my playlist and the link will be available in the description and I button. We'll see you in another video. Till then take care of yourself. Bye-bye.